All right, so this exercise is a very unconventional one for the chest. This is the landmine floor press. So if you don't know what a floor press is, it's exactly like a bench press, but you're on the floor. You can do it with dumbbells, you can do it with a bar. Um, but the idea on the floor press is you come down with the weight, touch your elbows or your triceps to the floor, and press up. But you want to come to a dead stop. You don't want to bounce, okay? Now, bouncing off the floor, you're touching the floor to a dead stop, pressing the weight up. The difference between this exercise and a bar uh, floor press and a dumbbell floor press or even a kettlebell floor press is that we're using the landmine. Now, I haven't really seen anybody else do this exercise. I started doing this a few years ago when I had a major shoulder issue and I couldn't really use the bar. Um, so I tried it, worked pretty well, and now I throw it in occasionally when I'm doing my chest. The key here though is that you have to make sure that you're not going super heavy with it unless you have somebody to help you with the weight, okay? Because to get in the proper position with it, it's gonna be tough to do if you're by yourself. So this is a great exercise to do at the end of your chest workout to go for high reps, maybe 20, 30, 40, 50 reps each side. It's a single arm movement. And this way you're not so focused on dropping the weight on you or you know, putting the weight down after you're tired. Because a lot of times with chest exercises, if you go super heavy and you put the weights down properly, you can really do some damage to your shoulder. You really want to avoid that. So very simple to do. The setup you have here is a bar either tucked in a landmine device, which I can link up in the description section for you below if you don't know what it is. But basically it's, a, it's an attachment on a swivel that you put the bar in on one end. The other bar is free and it swivels in the landmine. If you want to try this exercise and maybe you don't have a landmine, another way you can do it is take a towel and shove it into a corner, preferably with concrete floors and block walls. You don't really want to do this with, um, with uh, drywall. You want to do it with something that's, that's a little bit more sturdy, so usually block walls are great for this. But you take a towel, you jam it in the corner, and then you jam the bar into the towel, and the towel will kind of hug the bar a little bit to, so the bar doesn't move around in the corner. So you can try that as well. Not the best way to do it, preferably a landmine would be best, but you know, you gotta make do with what you have. You put a weight on the bar. Um, obviously, if you use a 45 for this, it's gonna keep the bar a little higher off the ground. It'll be a little bit easier to get in position, but I have a 25 on today. So let's just show you the movement. Very simple to do. What you do is lay down next to the landmine here, okay? You grab the bar with both hands, and you turn into position. So grab the, grab the landmine with both hands, like a baseball bat, turn the position, and now you're ready to go. All right, keep your elbows in, touch the floor, and press. Make sure the wrist is nice and straight. And that's it. When you put it down, you go down the same way you came up. So elbow down first, rotate the hips and the body, and put it down. Now when you go to do the other side, you actually want to be on the other side of the landmine. You don't want the bar going across your body this way to do the other side. Okay, so just switch your body position, same thing, you roll up on that side, you're here, and you're pressing up this way. And when you're done, go away from the bar, put the bar down. Very simple to do. Great burner exercise at the end of your chest workout. Give it a shot, let me know what you what you think in the comment section below. If you like this video, please comment, like I said, like it, um, subscribe to this channel. If you wanna see all of my videos on men's health and fitness, things like getting really strong, building muscle, getting lean, um, and other topics like dad life motivation, all kinds of cool stuff to help you maximize your life, go to AmericanBullyTV.co, that's AmericanBullyTV.co, that will take you to my main Rumble channel, where you can subscribe and see all the videos that I put up daily. All right. Don't forget guys, one last thing, check the description section below for, um, for some cool links. I'll link up the landmine for you. And I'll also link up some cool things like some cool chest workouts you can do as well. All right guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.